So I'm just put down I physiology, I guess. Uh, 10, 17. So this is the, the, that pretty much it. You just want to go over like that. Um, yeah. Just, just to start off, just the retinol, is that your question? Yeah, basically. <laughs> just because we, I mean, we talked about that a little bit in one session, but I didn't really think we went over it that much. We just talked yeah. about the retinol and how it, once it receives a stimulus or an extra potential or something, it sends out the option. Yes. So, so option cycle or something. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. So, you, so we're basically you just want to focus on this retinol. I mean, what happens when light hits it? Is it comes straight and dry? The bonds change, mm -hmm. and so it goes to. This is what kind of formation is it? Is it right here? Cis or trans? Mm -hmm. Isn't it in the trans right now? No, so it's in the cis. Cis. Because trans are straight. Trans yes. Straight. Trans are who is that? Oh, I'll call him later. Okay, yeah, so basically all you need to know is that it starts in the cis form, cis bond, and then when the light hits it, it causes a, a chemical Changes. change, so then it becomes straight, and this is trans. Okay. I think that's all to your question. Was did he yeah, mention anything else more specific? No, that's pretty much it, I guess. There's, and then how does it go back to being cis bond? Because the diagram shows it going back. It just comes back in. Once light stops stimulating it, it comes back in. Yeah.